Hey, GED students, it's GED question of the daytime, and we've got a little word problem here that's got some algebra in it. Um, as usual, when you have a word problem, when you have algebra on the GED, you get a calculator. So go arm yourself with your TI-30XS multi-view calculator, and um, let's check this out. It says, Blackson's accounting firm gives a bonus to employees after each tax season. The year this year, their bonus can be found based on the formula B equals uh, 2 hundredths S plus 150, where B is the bonus and S is their annual salary. If Tom's annual salary is $62,000, lucky Tom, <laughs> how much will he receive as a bonus? I think, y'all, I might need Tom's job. Okay, I don't get bonuses or such a glorious <laughs> annual salary. <laughs> Anyway, sorry, I'll focus y'all. Okay, so looking at this problem, a lot of students freak out. They're like, oh my God, it looks so gross. I don't know what to do, but the problem tells you what exactly what to do. It says, use a formula. This formula right here is like a roadmap that tells me what to do. So the very first thing I'm gonna do is just copy down this formula here. When you see a formula in the problem, you should cheer. You are not gonna have to really interpret the word problem. You're just going to have to Put in any information you know into the formula and then chug along to find the answer. Let me show you what I mean. It says B, the letter B is the bonus. So this says if you'd like to find the B, the bonus, do this math. Okay, now that being said, we have a problem with doing that math. Part of it we don't know. We don't know what S is, but keep reading. It says S is their annual salary. The letter S stands for annual salary, and we know Tom's annual salary. Tom's annual salary is $62,000. That means S isn't a mystery anymore. S is known. Anytime you know something in algebra, go ahead and substitute that in. Trade out the letter, the mystery, for the known value. So what I'm going to do is I'm rewriting this sucker, but instead of writing S, I'm going to write what I know S is. So let's use a different color so you can see. S is $62,000. Notice how I plugged it in with parentheses. I did that for a reason. Uh, see how the 0 0.02 or 2 hundredths is shoved up against the S? Those two things are multiplying. And so I am writing about multiplication the way a mathematician would, using proximity and parentheses. So I get 0 0.02 times S, and then I'm supposed to add 150 to that. So I'll add 150 to that. And now's the time to pick up your GED calculator. This entire expression is all numbers and operations. There's no letters in it anymore, no variables. So you can just plug this entire thing into your calculator. 0 0.02 times 62,000, close parentheses, plus 150. And I get $1,390. $1,390. And ninety dollars, lucky, lucky Tom. So, how much is Tom going to get for his bonus? He is going to get a bonus of one thousand three hundred and ninety dollars. We're done. That easy was not challenging. Y'all got to stop getting intimidated by just seeing letters. All right. If you have any questions about this or any other GED math concept, be sure to drop it in the comments, and I'll do my best to answer it.